Hi everybody, welcome back to Haunted Town. Thanks for tuning us in. Ah, today. Luckily the the clouds have shined on us. Thank you Lord for sending us some not crazy sunshine, some clouds to block that sun, and some rain to cool it down. Ah, the rain. Rain is magical sometimes. We needed it. We were baking. It was bad. <laughs> In the shop today, really just cleaning things up. A little bit of rain dropping my head there. It's sprinkling. We just tuck on in here. Got the fan on. Cut that off real quick. Just going over everything, pretty much front to back, top to bottom. Looking real good. Oh yeah, and over here too. He'd been getting neglected, so. <laughs> New headlight. Everything works. Well, everything did work. <laughs> of course. Come over here and hit the key. Lights come on. <laughs> yep. <laughs> He's talking back. What's up, man? How you doing? Shut that fuel off there. <laughs> yep. Dagwood's real happy. He finally got some loving. I'm feeling good too. Everybody is finally running. We're real good. Let's just see. Since we say that. Fuel's off. Let's just see. Oh, it idles super low. Let me hit some choke down here. Yep, it's folded down. There we go. Idling super low because I got to turn way down. Be nice to that dream engine. Yep, lots of oil pressure too. Looking good. Thanks, Mr. Soichiro. Use my bro. Over here. Make sure I turn this key off. <laughs> yep, it's off. If you don't turn them keys off, them batteries go dead quick. <laughs> I'm sure we all know about that. Motorcycles and batteries. <sighs> Let's just see. Oh, you know what? I think she might still be out of gas still. Let's just see here. Uh, dang. I didn't put no gas in her yet. One sec. Okay, got some gas in her. Let's just see here. Choke's on. Oh, yeah. Oh, she's real happy. Sounds great. <laughs> yep, still needs to warm up. I just turned the choke off. Awesome. Everybody's running. <laughs> yes. And today was really just get the shop back in order because it was it's been a bit bonkers in here lately when it's that bonkers it's hard to think straight because everything's just in your way you can't find anything your tools are all over the place there's my pan of tools other tools this was all just my extra bits from redesigning here 
this wasn't just putting back together it was a complete redo redesign lots of parts redoing lots rewiring of some to move things around a bit to get it all done but it's done and works really good so good 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 only waiting on a couple more little parts over here she gonna be good to go a little bit more tuning time down here he's gonna be good he's ready to go real fast so yeah my other bit of tuning info over here too is sitting right here guys right here See that pipe? That pipe? That one's 109. Oh, that one's 110. The digital gun is really one of my tricks in tuning everything. I can point it at something and tell you exactly if that cylinder's running or not. See, all those are hitting. I can tell, yep, they're all over 100 degrees. Oh, that one's just a bit cool over there because it's just way, way far away. Yep, 99. So... Right there, guys. The Raytech. I got this one many years ago from Snap-on. <laughs> Snap-on. Snap-on. Sure you guys know them. But many places have the digital guns now. Just a LED gun. Shoots a beam. See, it shoots a little dot. Shoots a little dot. So you can see what temperature, what temperature sign is. Size 90. <laughs> yeah, it's still not cool out here today, but... See if I can focus that in. Yep, 94. <laughs> so 94 over there, up there on in the up there at the fan. 90 over here in the wall. So it's warm, but it's not terrible. Warm enough to get the shop all cleaned back up, get everybody running. Make me happy again. Make me want to come back and do stuff. When the shop is that extra, you don't even really want to come out here. Especially when it's hundred plus degrees. No, nah, I ain't doing nothing. Nope. <laughs> Towel. Yeah, it's still not the coolest, but it's is what it is, and got to get stuff done, so might as well. <laughs> one of my neighbors. I'm not the only one who makes noise around here. <laughs> oh yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, but over here, that's the biggie right there, guys. This is the only mess left. My motor is turned up on its back. <laughs> Need to get this one. <laughs> Have fun. Oh, he's getting it. Having a bunch of fun. <laughs> so I need to get this one. need to get the bottom end pulled apart. See what's really up with first gear because first gear is pretty much junk on this thing. So as soon as we get that figured out, that one is going to go into back into duty with a bunch more power. And because uh, once I get it rebuilt, I'm going to turn the boost way up on it because this one is already loving the boost too. So I think we're going to be good to go. And the boost is still turned way down. I have, it's just barely, wipe my leg off there and bug on me. The boost, the wastegate's just barely closed. Or just, just, it's just, it's sitting against the, the flange. <laughs> There's no pressure against it at all. And it still makes seven pounds of boost. So, there's a problem I was having before. The wastegate almost just doesn't really flow enough, but it's okay because it's tuned for that now. So, seven pounds is totally okay. I might go ahead and crank it up to 11 or 12 and see what happens. And that's probably going to happen at the racetrack where I can be safe and possibly set a record and do it all for meaning. Not just turn it up just to see what it'll do. <laughs> Duh. I know it'll go fast. I think you guys do too. Way more to come as usual. Like, share, and subscribe. It's time. Shop's all cleaned up. Everybody's coming together. Thanks a whole lot for watching, guys. Let's go.
and you'll see what I